studs. Hope you guys are doing well. Hope you're ready to learn some math today. We have a lot to do, so please get out your pens, pencils, calculators, and notebooks and books, and let's get started. Um, first of all, there will be a quiz next week. I believe that quiz will be Tuesday, more than likely. We're going to do some more factoring today, some more factoring on Monday, and a quiz on Tuesday or Wednesday of next week. So I will give you more details on that next week. At this time, go ahead and turn in your factoring homework. Abby and Blake, um, always give, always put your homework in my box, okay? Don't give that to Mrs. Walker. She's busy. <clears throat> So Abby and Blake, you will always put yours in my box. The rest of your students, go ahead at this time. Please put your name on your homework. Pass it up to Mrs. Stewart. And Mrs. Stewart, if you'll always put those in my box, I would appreciate it, okay? So there we go, guys. Um, at this time, go ahead and turn your homework in. I'm going to continue on. So please listen while you're doing that. Today, I will actually be taking it easy on you just a little bit. We will be we will be watching two videos again and doing homework. However, the two teaching videos combined are only 30 minutes long, and the homework's not long at all. I think you might be able to finish it in class. So if you'll work hard, don't goof around. You might find yourself going home with no homework over the weekend. Okay. And by the way, in this class, every day, 99.9% .9 of the time, it's going to be notes and homework notes and homework, okay? This is an honors type of class, so we really work hard. The videos, once again, will be factoring. Next week will be our first quiz, and it will cover factoring. Please, please learn this factoring. We're going to use it all year, all year long, so you may as well learn it now so you can do other problems later. <clears throat> the names of the teaching videos are Factoring the difference of perfect squares and factoring the sum and difference of perfect cubes. I would watch them in this order if I were you. This video first, this video second. The homework will once again be strictly on the computer. So let me talk about this, okay? Um, uh, there's no handouts. There's no book to look at. You simply turn the homework help video on. And, and follow along. Now, you don't have to listen. You can copy the problem down, factor it on your own, and then fast forward the video to see if you got it right. Now, today, it's going to be a little awkward, okay, because you are going to finish the videos and start working on homework in the class. So, Mrs. Stewart, I would definitely turn the homework video on and let it play so the students can copy the problems, or maybe, here's a better idea, maybe what you could do, Mrs. Stewart, is turn the homework video on after the teaching videos are over and have the have the students copy down the first problem then fast forward it, then copy down the second problem then fast forward it have them copy down the third problem etc until they have all the problems copied down there's not that many at all I think maybe seven or eight or something like that all right so um, there we go um, and let's see I think that's it that's it for today, guys. Go ahead and get started on your two teaching videos and then work on your homework. Have a great weekend. Contact me if you have any questions.